Hi, this is GT or Gadget Trish back with part two on how I pimped my Canon HV30. For those who have Canon HV20 or 40 models, don't feel left out. This does apply to you. And this particular mean green theme was done on purpose to demonstrate um, why you would use this particular rig that I designed today. Now, in part one, that was specifically designed for a moving subject and pretty much trying to uh, st simulate um, a pro-consumer camera with how they have the handles so you can have a better control of your movement, especially if you're following someone. This one's a little bit different. This is more for like interviews or studio type uh, scenarios like this one or if you're doing any kind of night shooting and you need to see your subject and you need two microphones. So, um, this rig consists of the Beach Tech, the Roll Condenser Shotgun Microphone Kit, a Sennheiser Wireless Mic, the Irv Manual Focus, the Pierce Stone Wide Angle Lens, an extended battery, a standard uh, cold shoe uh, video bracket, but in addition, we're adding a right angle bracket, we're adding a pan, uh, light pans, camera light, and we're using the Manfrotto tripod instead of the Cam Caddy. Um, in this case, uh, let's just show the difference. This is with the pan light on. And as you see, it's bringing more light into my face. When we do um, shoots at night, when we're interviewing people, and we just need a little bit more color or light in the subject, this is perfect. Um, this is definitely not budget friendly. This is for someone that is considering doing some kind of a career in video shooting, but you're still not sure if you can make that commitment financially like myself. This is a great plan B. And what's great about the things that I, I purchased for this particular camera is most of the stuff I could use for a future upgrade camera and um, now that some of the digital um, SLRs are coming with video capability, some of these items are also compatible with it as well. So it's definitely not a waste. Um, definitely when you're purchasing gadgets, try to make sure, if it's possible, to have multiple uses for them. Don't just limit yourself, oh, this is for that and that is for that. The filters that I purchased for my Canon HV30 um, also fit on my digital SLR and um, that's a win-win when you get multi multi use um, things I also use the caddy for other um, cameras like my uh, ca Casio XLM because that has video and you know so that's it for today and um, I hope you enjoyed this segment and on that note, I'm out. Bye.